name's Graham Clark and I'm a member of Skelton Bowling Club's committee. We run four teams in uh, the local leagues. Uh, we play in afternoons and we play to, on evenings. And uh, we've won the uh, Cleveland County, uh, the Cleveland League trophy for the last five years. And uh, hopefully this year we may return the trophy. We've been carrying out sort of a, a fundraising thing over the year. Uh, and we've wrote to some of the local companies and uh, we we had a, a campaign to get a defibrillator which is on the on the wall outside and we got a lot of people who, who you know came and volunteered to, to, to assist to purchase the defibrillator and we've got five members who, who used to work for ICL uh, there's a hundred and thirty years worth of service out on that one on, on the green normally uh, and somebody suggested, you know, possibly just send an email to, you know, to ICL and see what they can do for us. I work for CPL, well, sorry, ICL, formerly CPL. Uh, I was in my 24th year. Well, obviously, I didn't want to go to seed, having uh, finished work. So I took up yoga, took up bowls, got a dog, and tried to stay healthy and fit. The camaraderie is good as well. We found out that we need wetting agent on the green. Uh, so we've, we've started using the wetting, wetting agent and the fertiliser etc is, uh, is there to be used. But the main thing when we asked, we asked ICL for financial assistance was to be able to buy this sorrel roller and uh, that's going to allow us to purchase a roller. The roller does puts indents into the green without damaging the green which lets the air in which then you know, let's assist the grass to grow. It's going to help us to improve the green. I mean, we've got an extra 15 people who've joined, so the, the amount of activity on the green, like you can see now, you know, that, that, com that creates compactness. This, this, this is going to assist with, you know, with that. As the college, I usually do come uh, to bowls after I've got matches, so I have to manage it with my college and education. But it fits in all right, and so me and my granddad could bond over, really. It's something to do when you get into your nearly 80s and it's just nice and they're all friendly and you come up for a laugh. I started uh, July last year, the middle of July, and uh, I started playing then. And I've, I came up for an open night and uh, I was a bit dubious. It was like going to school for the first time. And uh, I came in and I thought, oh, I don't know anybody here and they just greeted me and they were just all friends as if I'd been coming for years. And obviously the people now, the people are aware of what's going on from the local company and as I say now we're five people with 125 years of service or whatever, they feel really, well they, they feel appreciated I think, you know, a long lot of years after the, you know, they've retired.